what up everybody welcome back to way of the hunter and today we are once again working our way through our herds and seeing if any of our animals become five star we have several that are that at last check were four um and we are currently working on getting to a location for our warthog uh, if you recall, we, we first spotted him as a three-star adult. Uh, last time we saw him, he was a four-star mature. Had been a four-star mature for several days. Um, so I'm thinking he's probably just about due to go to five stars. Anyways, if you do find yourself enjoying Way of the Hunter, I would appreciate it if you would click on that like button. It helps me out. It lets me know you guys want to see more of this kind of content. Also helps with the YouTube algorithm and getting the video out to more people. And if you have not yet subscribed, I would appreciate it if you would consider subscribing to the channel. As again, it does help me out. Uh, but for now, we're going to uh, continue making our way over here to the hunting stand. The hunting stand. And see if we can finally get ourselves a five-star warthog all right guys well we just got a uh, very brief spot on him and he has gone to a five star so we're going to first of all activate this mission and we're going to try to draw him in to us there he is right there we're going to try to draw him in to us I, I would i would like to take him out with the bow if i can but looks like he's not willing to come that far Yeah, he's not. So we're going to go ahead and get out of the hunting stand. We have some greater kudu right there that we're going to spook here in just a second. And we're going to hopefully not spook him towards the warthogs. In fact, we're going to go this way and take advantage of the wind. They, they they did get spooked and they thankfully went away from the warthogs is right there
on stop moving. You would stop moving there, wouldn't you? Dropped him. Oh, look at them. They ran over to check him out, make sure he's okay. <clears throat> that gives us our first five star warthog. That's exciting because I've been tracking this guy for a long time. And we got him in the heart and the right lung. Look at that. Look at that shot. From 58.8 yards. 86.98% on the genetics. He had a, wow, only a score of 449, which I'm guessing is probably at the very bottom of the five-star rating. And let, let's go ahead and take a look at the model here. That, that looks amazing. In fact, let's, let's hide the UI here. And, and you know what? We are we are going to uh, take a photo of this. All right, so let's go ahead and taxidermy him. And we'll continue working our way through the day and see if we get anything else. All right, guys. Well, we're coming to the end of yet another day of chasing 
our, our animals. And last night I was doing this and I came across a five-star Egyptian goose. And I thought it would make a great way to end a video. Had it all lined up and missed my shot. And I thought all was lost. Once I had advanced to a new day, but I have found this flock of geese once again. And I'm pretty sure it's the same flock. Uh, but anyways, we do have a five-star Egyptian goose in here right now. He's in the bush. So we're going to just try to be patient and wait for him to come back out. And hopefully when he does come out, we actually have a clear view of which one he is. And as you can see, we're right by the uh, little campground, campsite that is in the very top left corner of the map is it him it is him All right get the get the bow out All right, looks like we got something. Uh, hopefully it's the five star. Shot it from 60 yards. And it is the five star. Uh, only 86.85% on the genetics. For a score of 459.8. But we are definitely going to taxidermy him. And I think that's going to do it for uh, this one, guys. If you uh, did find yourself enjoying Way of the Hunter, I would appreciate it if you would click on that like button. As it does help me out. And lets me know what kind of content you guys want to see. And if you have not yet subscribed, I would appreciate it if you would consider subscribing to the channel. As it also helps me out and lets me know what kind of content you guys want to see. But with this, we will go ahead and talk to you all next time.